Welcome to another episode of Electronic Cafe Celebrates. In this particular episode, we're looking at a massive pioneering album from the incredible Art of Noise. Who's Afraid of the Art of Noise? It was the debut studio album by the very avant-garde synth pop group, um, released on the 19th of June by the well-known, incredibly famous ZTT record label. Released in 1984, this was the first album released by the Art of Noise, preceded only by the 12-inch EP Into Battle with the Art of Noise which incidentally was also the first release by ZTT Records. As you can imagine, with a band consisting of Gary Langan, Trevor Horn, Anne Dudley and JJ Jexilic, not sure what Paul Morley did, the album was self-produced by the Art of Noise themselves. It featured the UK hit singles Close to the Edge, which reached number eight in the UK chart, and the double A-sided Moments in Love beatbox, which made it to number 51, which surprised me because it's such a well-known song, I really thought it charted higher. The album was truly groundbreaking. You have to realise this is 1984. This was the forefront of sampling and the new Fairlight CMI sampling synthesizer. Who's Afraid of the Art of Noise slammed together samples, heavy grooves, beats, screwed up vocals and orchestration. A kaleidoscope of everything you can imagine. All the tracks written by Anne Dudley, Trevor Horn, friend of the Electronic Cafe, JJ Jexelik. We did an interview with him a year or so ago. If you haven't seen that, check that episode out. A true gentleman, lovely guy incredibly talented, uh, Gary Lanigan and Paul Morley. This was 1984, there were no boundaries. This was the Wild West where sample time was limited to only a few seconds, but rarely has something aiming for modern pop status also sought to destroy and disturb so effectively. But I guess that was ZTT all over. Um, I really like this album because even though Simps and that kind of sampling stuff was becoming really big, these guys really led the way on that. Um, absolutely beautiful in parts and um, catchy as hell in others well worth checking out um, Who's Afraid of the Art of Noise is just one of those defining moments in the 80s uh, um, will live for most of the people my age and if you haven't heard it or um, listened to it before then you need to hear it it's a, it's a great album and if you're interested in the origins of the art of noise, the epiphany moment, you only need to check out the eight minute red and blue dance remix of Owner of a Lonely Heart by Yes from 1983, produced by Trevor Horn, engineered by Gary Langan with JJ Jexidic on programming. Oh. 